part of the town. There's only 7,000 people in it. It's called the Shimna River. So we are Newcastle upon Shimna. You've never ever heard of that. So uh, that's where I'm from. A uh, very small town with 7,000 people. And um, I've been in business for many, many years. I have a family. I have six children. And um, I heard about this company in April of this year. So I'm a new kid on the block, like a lot of you. A lot of us are very, very new to this idea. But I've had extreme success, and I'm delighted uh, to have been introduced to FutureNet because it's phenomenal. And I know a lot of you here have been invited for the very first time. Maybe you, you don't fully understand why you're here tonight. Maybe you don't have much information at this stage. But tonight's just an introduction to our company. We've actually got our CEO and founder with us tonight. We'll be hearing from him a little bit later. And uh, it's just to kick off this whole London region. Uh, I think if you're from this area, and I know a lot of people have traveled in, but I know if you're from this area, you are in a population here of probably close on 20 million people, I would guess, in, uh, in a 25 or 30 mile radius. And from that, this business can go entirely global. So I wish I was from this area to have the contacts uh, that's <coughs> endless. And my little town is only 7,000 people, but uh, I built a little business already with about 3,500 people uh, in FutureNet. So that's half my town, so I'm proud of that. Um, but they're all over the place. They're all over the world. They're all over the UK. And you too can build a business from the comfort of your own home. So what my job to do tonight is very, very easy. It's just to share the idea with you, to give you a feeling about this, to give you an understanding of what Future is, FutureNet is, and how you can benefit from it. That's quite important. So FutureNet is all about social media. And social media, I believe, has changed probably every one of our lives. Um, my dad is 78 years of age. He only got a phone about eight years ago when he was 70. Uh, a mobile phone. He wouldn't touch mobile phones until uh, about eight years ago. He got, it, it was given to him as a present. And you, you'd get three text messages a year from him. That's, that's where he is in terms of communication. But recently now he's on uh, Facebook. He's now come on as one of my customers on FutureNet. And it's, it's telling me that from the very young to the aged, everybody is affected by social media. There are so many platforms out there uh, it's a very, very exciting arena of business. We have people on their phones wherever you look today. When you, this meeting's over, everybody will run outside these doors and they'll go straight onto their app. They'll check their Facebook, they'll check their FutureNet, they'll check their Instagram, they'll check their all these different social media platforms. It's really, really changing our lives. And everywhere you look, whether it's on the tube, whether it's on the bus station, whether it's on the street, whether it's at work, whether it's sitting in the car, everybody is on the phone. Even sitting in a restaurant, you can see three or four people sitting down for a meal. They've got their phones interrupting the meal. If you leave the house tonight without your phone, I bet you, you would really, really consider it so much further. You'd probably better go back home and get your phone. You feel there's something missing. Because what's happened with communications is it's made the world a very, very small place. And oh, we talk about Big Brother looking down on us. Guys, these phones are connecting the people globally. It's incredible. So FutureNet is in this arena, and what these people are doing is they're liking, they're sharing, they're posting, they're Snapchatting, they're Instagramming, they're YouTubing, they're liking and sharing, they're doing all of these activities, and you're guilty of that too. We do it every day. But my question to you is, how much do you get paid for clicking, liking, and sharing? How much do you get paid for your social media content? Do you realize that you are worth a lot.